Welcome back. The creativity will be flowing and family fun will be a plenty at this weekend's Lakeshore Art Festival in Muskegon. Join us with details is director of it all, Carla Flanders. Good morning. Thanks so much for joining us. Good morning. Thanks for having me. It is our pleasure. So it's my understanding that this is kind of a new weekend for all of this? Yes, it is. Historically, we've had it the first weekend of July, but this year we will be having it this coming weekend. So June 26 and 27, it is a Saturday and Sunday event. Let's explain to everybody kind of the location where this all takes place. Yes. Well, first of all, the event is a celebration of all things art, as you kind of touched on. And so what we have is the fine art section, which happens in Hackley Park right in downtown Muskegon. And then we have a craft, all handcrafted products that goes down 4th Street to Western Avenue. And then from um, probably the arena area to the farmer's market on Western is the handcrafted area and also includes the children's lane. So it's a really a lot of the downtown area. And it also includes 3rd Street, which is where all of our yummy food vendors are. Well, let's go ahead and talk about the artist and the crafters. How many people are expecting and what types of things do they bring? And is it for sale? Yes, absolutely. The event is free, but we ask you to bring your money, please, because we really want to support all of these entrepreneurs and these artists. So in the fine art category, there will be about 100 fine artists that are from all over the country, and those will be in the park, and they'll have everything from paintings to jewelry to uh, pottery and things for your home. And then in the craft section, they'll have similar things, but it will be at the handcrafted level. So you can find cute, fun things for your house, for gifts, for graduates, for, um, you know, birthdays coming up and things like that. And so that again is on Western Avenue. And then the children's lane, we will have about 15 um, units there that will be doing some hands-on activity. There won't be a ton of hands-on because as we were putting this together, we were being very um, COVID safe, but there will be um, canvas painting there. There still will be face painting there as well. And then we will have a scavenger hunt that's gonna be put on by the 4-H group here through the MSU Extension Office where anybody can participate. You can just go to our website at lakeshoreartfestival.org, download the app, um, complete some of the challenges and be entered to win a prize at the end of the scavenger hunt. Great, and what is Authors Alley? The Authors Alley is a collaboration of about 20 Michigan authors that are going to be at the corner of Fourth and Clay. And you can go on down there, visit with the authors, talk to them about their books, and just meet them and they'll sign your book and you can purchase one from them. And it says you guys are going to have street performers all around the area too? What kinds of street performers? Yes, yeah. So uh, we will have performers. They will be taking place at the Oltoff stage and at Hackley Park stage. So come on down, you can grab some food. There'll be pic picnic tables spaced out and you can eat and drink and uh, watch some entertainment. And speaking of drinking, can I mention the social district as well? Absolutely, we love our social district here in Grand Rapids. So absolutely mention that. Right, so downtown Muskegon also has a social district and this social district is right in the heart of the Lakeshore Art Festival. So you can visit, visit one of our local establishments such as Pigeon Hill, Unruly, Smash Wine Bar, and you can walk throughout our festival footprint while you're sipping on your 